odds. I know you were raised Catholic, strict yeah. Catholic. Yeah. I, I was raised Catholic too. So I know we both I feel. Condolence I know we. This would be a terrible house to be drunk in. <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling really just no. ruined, priceless artifacts. The only thing, right. the only thing I drink is flan. Oh. I mean, I'm hoping I get to be a piñata uh, <laughs> this Christmas, you know. Jesus, but Buddha, and Christ, and the Beatles—they all agree. All you need is love. And part of what made it work is that it's hard hitting it's a scary, it's classical, but. The ending hits you like a motherfucker. <laughs> By the way, if there are children in the audience, it's too late. But you should leave. What was your favorite moment of the evening? To me, uh, Francis McDormand's speech was phenomenal. And sharing sandwiches and candy with an audience was also great. Anyway, that, so there's real proper grown-up vampires in this? Indeed they are. And, oh. and uh, partially was to reinvent uh, the biology of the vampires, right. the anatomy and so forth, we answer an age-old question, which is what happens to vampires' genitals? Oh, really? <laughs> what page is that on? Page. <laughs> it's hard to survive past the age of 10. But once you make it, you are fully formed and uh, fair. I'm a profoundly imperfect motherfucker. <laughs> so. Get that on a t-shirt. Geography, religion, Gender, these are a lot of things that we construct to operate as a society. But they are not real. If you look at geography, it's not real. There, isn't, there are no lines delimiting uh, the U.S. and Mexico. If you take a photo of a satellite, it's just Earth and water. And the fact that we accept those boundaries, their inventions, their fantasy. <laughs> that is correct. How the devil are you, sir? I feel heavier. <laughs> <laughs> it must be the canopies. <laughs> Miles, Guillermo, thank you so much. Congrats.